Hey guys, Balubish here. Uh, I just found out a couple of friends had Steam VR performance tests. So if you want to try out and see if your PC can handle a uh, Steam VR headset, you can just install it fr from the Steam store and uh, try it out. So I just ran a test uh, test run just to see how it works. So uh, I'm gonna show you guys now and I'm gonna add some nice music to listen while it's running and let's talk about the end results. <laughs> So there we go, test is done. Uh, my PC is VR capable. Uh, it's not ready and it's because uh, my graphics card as you can see is yellow. Even though I have a GTX 780 water cooled, it's not enough to push games. Uh, uh, Operating system is fine. CPU is fine, uh, but you definitely want to be in the green area uh, if you're gonna buy a headset. The uh, reason is, well, it's 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 kind of stupid, really. Uh, wow, I should have actually be higher. It's on the test were in average fidelity medium. Uh, you can change it for some reason, I don't know why, but it tests if you're below 90 frames per second, because uh, having those screens too, so close to your eyes, you need to have at least 90 frames per second to not get sick while playing with it. And I'm not sure what CPU bound frames means, but... Don't mind that. The first test I got frames below 90 FPS, 0.1%. So I can basically play all games or most of the games on medium settings, but to get the best uh, VR feeling or experience, you should definitely have a better graphics card or a better PC uh, so you can run all games on very high settings it will probably be a lot better to play the games like that. Uh, also notes your system USB capable of not being able to leave. Uh, 
Um, I know I, ha I have USB 3.0, so I, I'm pretty sure you don't need higher than that. But USB 3.0, you need at least for um, Oculus Rift, so it's probably the same for Steam VR. But yeah, if you wanna check out if your PC can handle it, um, I could definitely buy a headset if I wanted to and play some games at medium settings. But is it worth it? I don't think so. I'm probably gonna wait um, until I have a better graphics card and then, oh yeah, baby. So if you wanna test it out, download it on Steam, Steam VR performance test and test your PC and let me know in the comments what score you get. See you later guys.